previously on WWE 2K22. Oh, I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. I don't like this. We got no weapon. Maybe we should have opted for a weapon. This is not going well for me. Oh no, oh no. And they have my shovel. I should have really considered getting a weapon. This is not cool. It's not how I imagined WrestleMania to go. Oh, a swerve. About as sweet as McMahon and Austin turning on the rock. Oh, got him. Got him with a curb stomp and we beat him. We are the new WWE champion. And I guess the new Messiah now. Oh, wow. How have the tables have been turned? Wow. Highly unexpected. Thank you, gentlemen. What a way to finish the show. The show of shows. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're going to continue with our storyline against Seth Rollins. We just won the world title. Uh, the WWE world title, I should say. And a swerve at uh, WrestleMania. Alright, let's continue... Oh, we have a steel cage match. Oh, interesting. On Raw. Why is it on Raw? Not like another pay-per-view. Man, she just really is out for me. When I was a face, she hated me. When I was a heel, she hates me. What the hell? That's why you're not GM anymore. All right, the Messiah versus the awesome. Burn it down. We are not going to burn it down. We just started. Leave us alone. Introducing the challenger from Davenport, Iowa. Weighing in at 200. I like that's the challenger. He's going to remain challenger after this. Rollins. And introducing the champion from Tampa, Florida. He is so focused that he can levitate the title. That's amazing. And even the referees mean mugging. Up close and personal with the referee's nostril. Let's get her done. Formalities are over. go oh missed the drop kick close line back of the head already got him down TKO boom so they want us to escape oh we're like right on the side ouch probably hurt us both oh that's ironic The curb stop right on the man does the curb stomp. We are like all over him right now. Fair hill ending, not for Seth. Let's go. Let's just try. Oh, we don't want to. No, we don't want to do this. Oh, wow. Okay. We just wanted to do something from the top rope. Oh god. Oh god. Really? Oh no. Is he gonna get to us? Oh, we're like right on the edge. Wow.
We're like turtling right now. Oh no. Oh no. We're going the wrong direction. Oh. Let's get down. All that just happened because we wanted to go the top rope. Oh, I tried to kick him. That didn't work. Because I wanted to go the top rope and all that commotion happened. <laughs> we almost won it by accident. Not really intending to end it yet. Oh, nice. Yeah, I don't want to fall into that trap again. I almost did it again just by habit. Got him with a flat liner. Oh, Simone drop. Ah, knew we were going to bust him open. Just didn't know how and didn't know when. Already got him tattooed. Oh, crap. That's not good. That's even worse. Border City Stretch. Fantastic. Oh, but we have to just make him escape, don't we? He can't do anything. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Caught him again. Dragon Whip. Oh, nice. Go behind. Oh, reverse Necrobreaker into a face buster. Oh, caught us. Nope. Another Dragon Whip. Arabian press. Oh, no. The springboard uh, splash. Oh, that's a good way to give myself a concussion. Not sure if we have a signature or not. I guess we'll wake him up here and see if we have anything. We do. We do. KO City. Boom. Lights out. Oh, he's properly knocked out. If that's already pushing me forward really fast. Game over, buddy. You just have to watch me just crab walk over. Game, set, match. Sorry, Seth. Sorry about your luck. Here is your winner, and still, the WWE Champion, the Captain. Oh! Fancy times, guys. Fancy times. We retain in our first, I guess, defense that I am aware of. Burying the competition. Uh, what do we have? New notification. Let's go check it out. No regrets. The greater good. Is that it? All the enlightenment you have to share upon us. Let's clear those. You got any story ones? With in all gaming as WWE champion, it's clear what I have to do. He's got something I want. I've climbed the mountain before and I now can do it again. Good luck with that. I'm not like any other mountain you've climbed, Drew McIntyre. Now that it's mine, you don't have a chance at gaining the WWE championship. I think you're getting a bit lightheaded up there on that mountain because you're not making any sense. Probably enough of the mountain talk. Now run along and go play with your toy sword and stay out of my way. Girlfriends in high places. 
Not sure if you saw, but Drew McIntyre has turned his attention to me and my WWE Championship. Wouldn't shut up about mountains. Not worried, just something to keep an eye on. I did see that. He keeps bothering me too for a championship match against you. Annoying. He'll help me deal with him? I can help, but I need a favor. Bianca Belair has also been frustrating me lately. Team up with me to take on Bianca and Montez Ford and I'll see what I can do about Drew. You scratch my back and I'll scratch yours. I like the sound of that. Me too, and who knows? Maybe you and I will make a good team. Now we're buddies, after you've been so salty against me. Now we're buddies, because I can do a favor for you. Interesting. Alright, so we have a little bit of a mixed tag situation here. One happy couple versus one very confusing couple. A couple of crazies, more like it. Start off with a strong TKO. Never really got the whole mixed tag thing. As soon as somebody makes a tag to their partner, then the other side kind of comes out. Oh, Arnold Palmer right at the back of the head. Oh, nice clothesline. Uh oh, what's she trying to do? Oh, missed the elbow. God dang it. She distracted me. Oh, snap mare. Drop kick to the side of that. Oh no. Oh no, standing moonsault. Oh, left that door open. Which is also, again, another pointless move because as soon as they tag out, my partner comes in. Oh, the back of the head. Nice Pele. See? Any fancy tag outs don't matter. Well, I just ran into nothing. Oh, just I like just get whipped with the hair. Getting your ass kicked right here, lady. There you go. Right in the boob. Low drop kick. Kind of like their face too. Oh, running me. That was nasty. That was nasty. As she turned her head up. Montez just doesn't understand the whole concept of tag team. Just gonna sit there and just stare. I mean, honestly, I probably would too. Nice. Oh. Ran into each other. Well, they kind of waffled a lot longer than the guys do. That's what I kind of wanted to do. Interrupt. <laughs> she took out Montez. That's hilarious. Just smothering her now. Oh, come on. Come on, video game. I can't do it. What the hell is he doing? Nope. Now I guess I can't counter this. You counter that though. Nice. Set him up perfectly with that little boot to the face. Stay on the cover. What are we going to be at here? Nothing, because the referee takes his sweet time going for a cover. Going for a pin. Oh, I tried to look at her, and it didn't let me. Why is it not letting me look at her? Oh, that's so lame. Oh, it's kind of cool, though, to do the moonsault. Oh, face rake. Almost punched his wife in the face. Oh, I guess he does a low drop kick too. The baseman drop kick. Oh, I missed up kick. No insecurity for me. Oh no. DDT, we reversed it. Oh. It was like a flash that we saw that.
Oh, we missed. We need to stop doing that. That was, for some reason, that was a very short-ranged one. I don't know if it was because, like, the camera angle or something that he was in. Or not the camera angle, but, like, the distance Montez was on the ground. Pod driver. Quarter city stretch. He's probably in the ropes, though, which sucks. Got him. Wow. Bianca was not in the ring at all. That was weird. Mandy came over there for the cutoff, and there was nobody to cut off. Fantastic. He needs to put WWE Champion. All right. They neglected that part, the most important part. Yeah, I did see their looks. It was priceless. It was perfect. It was actually what I was intending for, to blow them out of the water. Uh, scratch my back. How are you going to do that? Inquiring minds want to know. Uh, anyway, Drew's already won a number one contenders match, but we can make his championship opportunity extremely difficult. Thoughts on how you want to do that? So we can do a three on one handicap match. Uh, make Drew face Braun the same night. Put a five minute limit on Drew's title match. Huh? You know what? We'll make him face Braun that same night. Give Drew a warm up match right before he faces me against Braun Strowman. In an extreme rules match. Wow. Like the way you think. Now that we have that figured out, I'd love to discuss long term plans in person. You don't mind coming up to my hotel room? Well, yeah. And I guess on that note, we will put a momentary pause in this love connection until the next episode. <laughs> Alright, guys. Have a good weekend. Later.